With the end of Mutazem Uziel 139 we finally saw and expected Sayyid Salim to become the Sultan with the death of Sultan Suleiman the Magnificent. It was a struggle lasting for 14 years who should become the heir to Suleiman himself, in the end, it was the son of Huram Sultan. But Sayyid Salim did not expect to become Sultan, his famous comments are mentioned regarding he being the Sultan is reported from historical sources as following. My father Sultan Suleiman always wanted Sayyid Mehmed to become Sultan after his death, the army, religious leaders, and the Janissaries always wanted Sayyid Mustafa as the next Sultan. However after the death of Sayyid Mehmed, my mother Huram Sultan looked to Sayyid Bayezid to rival me and Sayyid Mustafa. Sayyid Sahangir was never considered an option because he was sick and weak. When my father killed Sayyid Mustafa, the fight for the throne was left for me and Sayyid Bayezid. While my father Suleiman stayed for a long time impartial while Mirama Sultan and Rustem Pasha favored Sayyid Bayezid I laid my trust in Allah, my mother died and Sayyid Bayezid was exiled to the province of Sayyid Mustafa before he was killed. Slowly, with the help of Allah I came closer to the throne, but no one, not even me expected to become the next Sultan after the death of Sultan Suleiman the Magnificent in 1566. What do you think, was it God's will or just conspiracies and intelligence that led Sayyid Salim to become the Sultan Salim II?